Lizzo and her team are still under fire, with her former backing dancers refusing to retract their allegations over poor treatment. Dancers Crystal Williams, Ariana Davis and Noel Rodriguez are keeping a united front when it comes to their allegations of a hostile work environment, which Lizzo has denied and labeled outrageous. Opening up to people, Williams said, we were treated poorly. Nobody did anything about it when we tried to speak up and advocate for ourselves. So now we're doing it. I know that my mind feels a lot clearer. There was a lot of anxiety and a lot of feelings of being overwhelmed once our suit was made public. But today, I feel very proud to be pursuing this with these ladies. Lizzo breaks silence on bombshell lawsuit and blasts false allegations following their complaints, which involved alleged religious, racial and sexual harassment, assault weight shaming and false imprisonment, the dancers filed a lawsuit on August 1st. In response, Lizzo released a statement a couple of days later denying the allegations made. She said, these sensationalized stories are coming from former employees who have already publicly admitted that they were told their behavior on tour was inappropriate and unprofessional. Since coming out publicly with the allegations, others who worked with the Juiced Star are backing the dancers. Don't miss, Beyonce fails to mention Lizzo on stage amid allegations against rapper. Video, Lizzo's dance captain Shirley Quigley tells fans God loves you after a lawsuit, reaction, Lizzo accused of sexual harassment and excruciating ordeal by former dancers, revealed, taking to Instagram, Lizzo's former creative director said, I haven't been a part of that world for around three years, for a reason. And I grieve parts of my own experience. Former dancer Courtney Hollingquest also wrote on her Instagram story, I'm not a part of the lawsuit, but this was very much my experience in my time there. Big shout out to the dancers who had the courage to bring this to light. Rodriguez told People the fact that other former employees were also coming forward was giving them the confidence to continue the fight. While Williams and David claim wrongful termination, Rodriguez says that she resigned from her role in protest of them being fired. They allege that when they requested a retainer, someone from the management team said their unacceptable and disrespectful behavior was grounds for termination. Williams added, those accusations, only came after, the, dance cast, that was predominantly either black women or women of color, started advocating for themselves and asking for better treatment and to be paid what we deserve on the job.